We started out pretty much like any other family. But 25-year-old Nicole O'Brien of Brockton and her family soon found themselves homeless, victims of the Boston Marathon bombing, even though they weren't anywhere near the finish line. Our new landlord called us and said, I can't let you guys move in. And we're just, we asked him, we said, why not? What happened? And he said the woman that was moving out was injured in the bombings. He goes, so she can't move out. Not having a place to live added more stress to being a college student at Bridgewater State University. So she and her mom searched online for help. She asked if there were any organizations that helped out with school supplies. Because at that point, I was using blank pieces of notebook paper that I had erased all of my notes from because we just couldn't afford it. Nicole found School on Wheels of Massachusetts. They specialize in helping students affected by homelessness. Cheryl Opper is executive director. The latest point in time study done by the Department of Education um, estimates that there's approximately 37,000 homeless school-aged children each year. Opera says the average age of a homeless person in Massachusetts is eight years old. And every time I say that, I've been saying that for 12 years, it still feels like it's a, it's a punch in the stomach. Since it was founded in 2004, School on Wheels Massachusetts has helped more than 2,000 students. They've also given out about 7,500 school supplies, including things like backpacks. Do you use mechanical pencils? After her first visit three years ago, Nicole walked out with more than enough supplies for school and a mentor. You know, I was fortunate that Nicole is very outgoing, very open, you know, communicates very well wanted a mentor and um, we ended up with a very natural relationship from the get-go. Kathy Strange has been in Nicole's life for three years. We all have struggles, right? They're just different struggles. For Nicole, a search for help turned out to be so much more. She will graduate from Bridgewater State University with a degree in criminal justice in just a few months and for that she credits School on Wheels of Massachusetts. I've never had to ask for anything. They always, do you need anything for the upcoming semester? It was, from the very moment I walked in, it was a very oh, welcoming environment. Tina Martin, WGBH News. School on Wheels offers assistance to kids from kindergarten through college. You can find more information on their programs and how you can help online at sowma.org.